All right, we are back with the Cory, Chapter Six, Prayers by Knights. Playing as Jacob. Emma. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Oh shit. Fuck. Well, who the fuck was that? Man. God, this night sucks ass. Jacob. Hello. Emma, is that you? We're about halfway through this game. There's ten chapters. Or six, so. Oh, we're at the... Yeah, we went to the little island. So we're over there by the treehouse thing now. I wonder if we're going to run into that creature that's over here. I got a feeling there's more than one. There's something here. What's this? We didn't see this earlier. Yeesh. I'm gonna fall off this. Oh. Alright. Man, that last chapter, that was intense. Fell off a dude's hand. I, I think that chick that we've seen at the end with the eye patch, I think that might have been, uh... The chick from the prologue, maybe. She lost her eye somehow? I don't know. Well, that bodes ill. Hell. What? I don't I don't know what just happened, but okay. Yeah, last time we didn't see Jacob or Emma. Got a feeling that's probably gonna be the majority of this one, maybe. Uh huh. His face. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my God, no way. Am I glad to see you? <laughs> oh shit. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ugh. You left me back there, you asshole. I had to go oh, save Emma, Abby. Come on. Or try to save Abby. What the fuck is going on? Look, I don't know, okay? Some like. Bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Who? When? Why? Sorry, I'm just... I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... What? It was like what, Emma? Like, out of a horror movie. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, um... Well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear trying to defend itself, you oh, know? Oh, don't be a dick. You, you know it wasn't a fucking bear. Well, you're right. You're right. And now we have these fucking the, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a fun new wrinkle. They did this to me. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, well, it's not mine. <laughs> mm, got quite the funky bouquet. No offense. Um, Okay. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. Oh, shit. Okay, you know what? You're right. Okay? You're right. I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please <laughs> not do this right now? Okay, seriously? I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something out here. Or things? Like plural? Wait, really? <sighs> well, fuck. <Run>! Yeah. How <laughs> bad his feet must be killing him running barefooted. 
about avoiding planks, the hard ground, brush, grass, what sticks. Oh shit. Hey dude, how you doing? Now, I wish the lighting was a little bit. Oh Sorry. shit. <laughs> oh, she's gonna be so mad at us. What's the lighting at times? It was a little bit better. I mean, I don't think it's bad lighting. This is fucking amazing. Uh, let's just run. Fuck it. Sorry, Emma. I'm not saying it's bad lighting or anything, but I wish at times I was trying to get some thumbnails and shit with some of the shit. And it's like so dark. It's like, ah. Oh shit, there's a pig. Why is it on a fucking head like that? Or a fucking spike? Oh shit. You better be careful, dude. There's fucking bear traps all around you. Oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> you just fucked up, dude. Uh, try to pry it open. Hopefully that doesn't clamp on our fucking fingers. I got a feeling if we pull it. Just like that bob wire, I got a feeling it's just really going to gash us open and really fuck us up. Ah, shit! Ah. There's a way to fucking unlatch the fucking things. Figure that out. And open it up. Oh, shit. What the hell? Who just came up and just knocked us out? What's oh, a chick? Chick in the water. The fuck is that? Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Should we do something? What can we do? She's dead. I mean, with the body. That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. I ain't oh man. man. Poor Kaylee. Mr. H ain't gonna Nick. be too happy. You smell so good. Yeah, I'm just gonna let them have a moment, but I think something's up with Nick. I think he's. Might be turning. Him and Abby both. Should we call someone or? Oh, fuck, Chris. How are we gonna tell Chris? Nick, what do you? I want to taste you. What? Hey. Yep, he's turning. Oh, yeah. Ugh, Nick, what the hell? We lost him. Ugh, get off! Ugh, watch out! Nick, get off! Shoot him. Somebody's got a gun. Yeah. What? Are you okay? I just wanted him to stop. What the fuck is he flailing for? Uh, let's come for Abby. Hey, hey, it's okay. You're okay. I got you. I got you. So I say, it looks like Ryan was trying to help Nick. What the fuck is going on? What did I do? I don't know. You okay, so dude? Okay. Yeah, he's turning. Let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. <laughs> you got like holy water or something in there? How much you screaming and flailing? Just try to rest. I'm sorry. moving so much it's pretty clean from what I could tell I mean it's not bleeding but you need to see a doctor look this is all I've got left in the nurse's station Ooh, fun. <laughs> better Ooh, hope fun. Uh, we find you some real help before they wear off we need to be keeping a record of everything that happens for the police yeah 
Dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? <sighs> Easy, man. I mean, like photos, whatever we can. I've got a funny feeling the cops are not going to want to believe any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now on, if you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. Okay. You okay over there, Abby? Look, Emma's way ahead, ahead of the. See if you can find anything to help make her more comfortable. I know, so we could crash with something over there by him. Grace probably actually just talking to him. Just. I wonder where Caleb is. Huh? All the way down, let's see if we can start opening these doors. There's something. Lockers? place was so different like 12 hours ago. I just think you got Jacob to think for all this. He didn't want to spend one more night with Emma. None of this would have happened. Nothing in this one. Next shower. I don't like that camera angle. I'll be able to look up. I think there's gonna be something on that back wall in one of these. Ooh, there's a arrow card. Maybe there had to be something in at least one. It wouldn't give you this many open rooms without something. That might be it. One more. Nope. No. Nothing on any of the back walls, but we have that arrow card. Talk to Nick. Thing in here. Oh, oh you know what? I'm supposed to be looking for her. I think I was kind of talking when she's telling us to go do something. Oh, well. We'll be alright. Something about making him more comfortable. Okay. Okay, I'll make you comfortable, dude. Here. That better? Thanks. Hey. Yo, something is not right with that boy. No, he's starting Dude to turn. Is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like a... He was like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. <laughs> you know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too. At the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit. Or scratched, or whatever. He just kept moving around like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt huh mm, rabies he's not frothing in the mouth <sighs> i think abby would beg to differ point it isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies hydrophobia yeah but i think it's more about a fear of drinking not just getting wet this was like like my cat in the bathtub <laughs> yeah Yeah? Can I ask you something? Of course. About we'll to eat you. Do you like me? Nick. Please, just tell me. I've 
really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. Such... Oh, such... Such... what? Such a cop-out answer. <sighs> okay. Abby? Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Why don't you like me, Abby? Nick, I do like you. No, no, you don't. You don't like me at all, do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. God, I sure know how to pick up. What? You're not really very smart, are you? Poor stupid Abby. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I... Oh shit. Oh damn. Whoa, Abby. Abby, everything okay? Holy shit. Kill him. Fucking kill him. Shoot him. Remember, pull the trigger all the way. Oh, there we go. No. Yeah. Hey, he was turning. I don't know if there's any going back from that. It's gonna be you or him. Oh, shit. Yeah, he full on turned right there. Her face, she's like, what just happened? Man, oh man, all right. Trying to stay alive, that's where. There's a beer bottle loader. Okay. So, if I were a counselor at an off season camp, partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters, I would. Go home to the lodge. I guess she had to think about that. A lighter and some fireworks. Only one left. Okay. That looks like those fireworks are going to come in handy multiple times. We just kind of showed up in style. First time we got them. Over yep, there's paper over here. Hmm. Ryan's stories again. I had no idea kids were getting freaked out about this stuff. We officially suck as counselors. There's another tent. Is this those two? There's another open one, but I guess not. I like how this game is more set up like an open world, almost. I know it's very linear. 
But like you could literally probably just walk wherever until a fucking cutscene pops up. Cause I know like on the map even, well, it's all connected. It's not like separate little maps you load into. It's like the same thing. Anything over here? That I see. Oh, there's something in that area. Maybe on that little rock. It didn't look like it's well, it looked like it's quite a ways up, but that rock didn't look like it was that far. Steps over here. hearing this whispering every so often and I know in the prologue we've seen the little ghostly figure I figure it's that fortune teller chick the hag of Hackett's quarry there's a like a noose probably more like a snare let's see if there's anything else I could look at doesn't look like it. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we've been hearing that whispering and then a little ghostly figure in the prologue. The whole hag of Hackett's quarry fuck earlier. Interest in when that's actually going to start playing a role in the actual story. So far, we're just running from these creatures and these hunters. She ain't doing more vlogs. Oh shit. Yep. No, don't do that. He cuts you and you know what will happen. Mm-hmm. Come on! Look. I've never done this before, Pop. Let's do it fast, that's it. So yeah, there's multiple ones. There's one right there. And you got this one roaming around. Let's just stay still. Don't alert anything. Maybe that creature doesn't know we're there either. That one looked like it looked at us. Fucking kids. Son of what? Oh shit. Yep. Fuck. Hey, stop. Stop squirming. Give me the try. Is she bit, huh? How am I supposed to know? I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Get the fuck away from me! Oh, oh shit. <laughs> oh. I'm just trying to help you. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the park record at his face. I see he found those matches and the fucking park record. It doesn't feel safe.
so much focus on that fucking Daddy? fireplace. Time we're in here. Ryan? Chill in a car. And sits up in the back seat. Oh, that man. Stereotypical horror movie. I killed him. I killed him. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. Right. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. No. No. He just threw you across the fucking room. Him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so fucked. How about none of y'all took a picture of that either? Or a video? Y'all hey. said y'all would. Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. So? Yeah. Don't let me in. It's not safe. It's a chick from the uh, Yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit. You Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes. You were supposed to be working uh Helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up. Uh, you and the guy, what's his name? Max. Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her inside. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. Captain her eye though. Oh, and that's in this chapter. All right, we gotta wait till next episode to figure it out. Here we are again. I'm Just so black. You and me. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? The moon. The moon. How poignant, tonight of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible futures? Sure. The then, cop top. from the One down, prologue as well. It's not terribly exciting. Alrighty, that's gonna be it for this episode. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you get notified when we upload new videos in. Leave a like and comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Until next time, peace out, Ely. Everybody love everybody.